Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Ninth Legion. Let's play some more Subnautica. We are... I'm not entirely sure where we are. We are close to the Lost River. In fact, we're actually below one of the entrances we had for the Lost River, I think. Um, but right now, I'm actually exploring a different path. Or at least a path I don't remember. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Okay. That was an unusual sound. What was that? I don't like unusual sounds that I don't recognise. Okay, we're going to continue pushing on this way. We were mucking about with the prawn suit last time. I picked up a new egg, which I think might be from one of those electric eels, which would be pretty cool. Got some resources. We did some science. You can't punch a rock to get resources out of it. But it looks like we've already kind of... We're on the edge of something here, because that is a really loud fish. That is surprisingly resilient and not dying. There we go. Now you're dead. Stop making all that noise. I hate noisy neighbours. So, this whole area down here... Ooh, there's some smoke events down there. Or, we can head down that way, which looks to go deeper. It looks like we're on the edge of, a, of another entrance to the Lost River. So, I'm very curious about what's actually down here. And by curious, I mean terrified, but... Actually, this looks... Yeah, this is the... That's, this is it. There we go. That's the Lost River. We're, we're there. Interesting, okay. But this isn't the back entrance we found last time. That's actually 300 meters away and a bit higher. Wow, this place is so big down here. I never realized the amount of hours. I've got almost 100 hours in this game, but I've never actually come down this far. Kind of shows you how terrified I am of the depths of the ocean, but hey. I mean, a lot of those hours were in versions of the game before they'd actually added all this in, I'll be honest. Um, I played a lot of the very early versions. Um, and that was like when you had the safe shallows, you had the seagrass regions, and that was it. Like, I played before there were reapers in there, in the game. You know, I played when there wasn't actually anything hostile in the game at all. Ooh, that's cool. Look at that. Are they living in the brine pool? Holy shit, there's stuff living in the brine pool. Okay, that's a bit crazy. I mean, that shit's acidic as hell, or toxic, or something. I don't know, it hurts to go in it. Don't go in it. Okay. We actually did see some of those in one of the precursor labs. Um, they were... Had some in stasis or something? There's also some red crystals down there. Is that aluminium oxide or is that something else? Because we are looking for some new resources down here. We're looking for keonite and sulfur. And I don't know quite where they appear yet. So, you know what? Let's check that out, shall we? We have the prawn. I can go out in the prawn check stuff out. I wish you could actually access, like, the prawn suit upgrades from here. I don't understand why I can't actually reach the panel and, and change stuff. Or access the storage. It just, just seems a bit silly to me. Whee! Damn it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Me. Wait. Whoa. That's a bit deeper in front of me than I expected. How deep does that go? Oh, God. Okay, the brine pool is deeper here than I expected. Um, we almost fell somewhere. I have no idea where. Get me out of there, please. Thank you. Right, what are you? Um, it is aluminium oxide. Okay. Well, I can pick up some of that. We always need aluminium oxide for stuff. Uh, that that is deeper over there than I. I'm not going down there. I don't. I don't care. That's just a big no. That's a huge no from me. Just no. No fucking way. Not dropping into something I can't actually see the bottom of at all. That's terrifying. Although there is stuff down there. What is that? Is that? Gel sacks? That might just be gel sacks. That's like my big deep dark fear of the ocean is when you can't see what's down below you. When it just drops off into the depths and you can't see stuff. That's that's bad. That's terrifying. This isn't where we came out last time. So where the hell does this branch of the Lost River go? Also it looks like it closes up a lot. This actually might need to be done with the prawn suit. Because I'm not sure I can get the Cyclops down those tunnels. They might not go anywhere. This might be a dead end or something. But let's have a look. Let's explore. No, no, no. There we go. You gotta be very finessey with this. Finessey? That's not a word. You gotta, you gotta be very careful with what you do with the prawn suit. It's, uh, it's a precise, powerful machine. And sometimes it's really hard to pick stuff up. Oh, okay, crap squid. That's fine. Um, I mean, I don't have the drill suit arm, so I can't, like, punch him in the face. 
Well, actually, no, I can't punch him in the face. But I can't drill his face off, which is my usual defensive tactic in the prawn suit. Is this... I can't, I'm struggling to remember. Is this the way we came in? Or came out last time? Because we seem really far away from that beacon I placed. But this does kind of look like the layered steps area with crab squids. That got us in last time. This might actually be the right way. This might actually be, be the way I was trying to find. And I just put my beacon in the wrong place or it moved or something? I don't know, I'm confused. Oh, what the dick was that? Yeah, back off, mate. I don't know what you just did, but don't. Because I will punch you. Repeatedly. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so it looks like they will attack me. They didn't do any damage, interestingly enough. And, oh, where'd he go? Okay. Actually, yeah, see, we did see a really infected crab squid last time we came through this area. Last time we left. Last time we left, we did see... I think this is actually the way I'm trying to find. I think I've actually come a different way to the same place. So that's actually cool. So... Yeah, because we were looking for that kind of area, weren't we? I think this is right. Yeah, I, th I think this is right. Okay, let's get back to the Cyclops. I can probably get the Cyclops down here, actually. In that case, because I got it out of here, so I must be able to get back in here. Um, right, hopefully those guys... Oh, there's actually a lot of you guys down here. Hopefully they're not going to cause me too many problems. Um, what's the actual range on this thing? Pretty far, I've got to be honest. That's not bad. Uh, um, unfortunately, I'm kind of... Yeah, that's fine. Luckily, the thrusters on this do, you know, recharge very quickly. Ah, that is actually pretty cool, swinging our way around like this. I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, okay. Range isn't unlimited. That's something to bear in mind. There we go. That's pretty cool. Uh, now, you might, you guys might actually be hearing some... Oh, crap, 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 crap. I don't know how deep that is. I don't want to go in there. Where's actual bay? Where do I need to go? I need to go up there. You guys might be hearing some additional watery noises, because right now the weather is very, very unkind. It is tipping it down outside my house, so if you do hear some rain in the distance, it's not because my sub's got a leak, I promise. Well, actually it does have a leak, but it's only a small one, and I should probably fix that, but I'm not going to. Gonna have to replant some stuff soon. Uh, I left my knife downstairs, didn't I? Let's do some food management quickly. Because uh, we're on a long expedition here. We don't want to run out of food. That would be the definition of bad. So grab that, drop that in there. And what we can do is we can. Wonder we'll just hit this up. No, we can actually do some planting quickly. Do, 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 do. That was not what I was trying to do. Plant that back again. Nope. Okay, for some reason I can't stab you. Stab. There we go. Thank you. All the stabbing. And you guys are okay. Fine. Right, let's continue on. Let's continue down. Uh, so it looks like we don't have to worry about fitting through those little gaps. We can actually go through these larger ones and just go down, which should be fine. Still no sign of sulphur or kyanite though. I have no idea what they look like, which is part going to be part of the problem. We will try and sneak past the crab squid though. We are in silent running, which basically means, you know, we travel slow and they can't see us. In fact, I might have just run one over, and they uh, they wouldn't even care if we hit them. They won't mind. Basically, they can't see us. They're blind to us, which is kind of cool. Hey, Mr. Crab Squid. Yep, yeah. I'm not actually here. You can't see me. Because I'm in silent running. And also losing frames. Hey, buddy. Yep, that's fine. Yep, that's fine. We're definitely in silent. Whoa, 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 whoa. Was that... Are you attack... We're not under attack. What the hell? What did you just do? I don't think that was aimed at us. Because we're still in silent running. He might have just actually been attacking fish. 
I have no idea what you're doing. We're not actually we're not getting the creature attack warning. So I don't think we're actually under attack. I think he's just being a dick. Um Oh, maybe he is trying to attack us. Are we taking damage from that? No, we're not. What? Oh, wow! It actually shorts out our electrical systems. Oh, wow, it's actually a full-on EMP attack. Okay. Interesting. I hadn't actually realized what that attack did. Um, it doesn't hurt us, though, which is fine. Are you going to do it again? Don't do it again. Ooh, that's actually really bad, because if that shorts out our electrical systems, and then we can't get away. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Okay, my arse is kind of caught on something. Stop! Do oh, Jesus, right. The there's another one. Okay, now there's two of them. Holy crap. Okay. Um, don't know why we're not getting the creature attack message, but that's fine. Let's just move on. Let's just leave all that behind us, shall we? If you guys could just not. That'd be lovely. We are picking up a number of hostile markers now. But they haven't actually caused any damage. They just fucked around with the electrics. That's fine. Okay, and we're back to this large cavern here. Yeah, okay, I know where we are. Good. Okay, that was actually the right way. We did actually come in the way I thought we were going to come in. Um, it just didn't really... We didn't approach it as I thought we would. So we've got a lot of hostiles around, but we should be okay, I think. These kind of bone eels. As long as we're inside and running, they shouldn't bother us. And hopefully they don't have, like, random electrical attacks. Um, now, we came from that direction. We approached from the face of the skull last time, so we need to find another way, which I'm guessing is down that way. It looks like there's actually another skeleton down there. Man, these ancient leviathans were huge. I don't like that. I'm not a fan of that. I'd also like to look around down here, but I'm a bit worried about the, uh, you know, giant monster fish. We do have the prawn suit though, so maybe I should just man up and go go for it. But I, I couldn't see anything in this area that we actually wanted to explore. It's like it's a cool spot to look around, but I think the the stuff we're really looking for is actually still still deeper. We are ooh, we're actually almost going to reach our maximum crush depth. I need Morning. to get external hull damage. Detected. That was me. That was me driving into something. It's fine. Very little damage. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, so this is all new now. We're finally, an episode and a half in, we're actually getting to see something new, but hey. No one should be watching me because they think I'm fast or efficient at playing games like this. Actually looks like a smaller skeleton. Let's switch to the cam. Yeah, that looks like a smaller ribcage. Maybe, maybe part of the tail? Maybe a separate creature? I'm not sure. Okay, I'm going to have to start being careful, because we can't go much deeper. I wasn't... I mean, the prawn suit goes down to 1300, so I guess, yeah, the map's going to go down to at least 1300. Um, I wasn't really sure what we'd need. Let's see what we can see in true here. Um, I can't use... I can't really use the camera mode, because I, then I can't see my crush depth. We've still got a bit. Let's switch on here. 765. Okay. We've still got 150 meters we can go down. Warning. External hull damage. Detected. That's fine. That's fine. That's just from me banging into stuff. Okay, we've got these kind of ghost rays again. They're pretty cool. They're nice and peaceful. I'm okay with that. Ghost rays are fine, to be honest. What is that? There's something down there. Now we now we need the cameras. What's our depth? Fine. We've got over 100 meters of depth. There's something above me as well. What's above me? That's terrifying. Something hostile above me and I can't see it. Oh, okay. There's a bone ray up there. Uh, bone eel. Damn it. So many things. All with different names. That looks like a little skeleton down there. Like a... Uh, well, I don't know what that looks like. What is that? Send a bit deeper. It's fine. Am I hitting something again? God damn it. What are you? 
going to reiterate, I've never actually been this deep before. I've never actually been in this part of the game. Despite my 100 hours in the game, this this is all new content to me. What was that? Okay, I thought I heard something. We're fine. What the hell are you? Warning. External hull damage That's fine. Detected. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. It's not a Reaper Leviathan. What is it? I mean, it's not the same as what we saw back up there. It's not like a baby version of that. It's an entirely different species. What are you doing here? I mean, it's a lovely place you've got here, but... Oh! Whoa! What the fuck is that? Okay. There's a... There's a thingy. We found a thingy. Um, there's also a passage that way. So we can go str basically straight on. There's another passage up that way. And there's a passage off to the side. Christ, okay. I don't know where we need to go. Where do we need to go? How much deeper can I go? 99 meters, okay. Okay, I kind of want to see... I want to see where all these go, basically. Uh, I'm not going to get out and look around. That might be scannable, but there's so many eels around. How would I How would I even manage that? I could probably try and lure them off with a beacon, maybe. Or just be really quick. I don't know. I don't want to go out. Because there's, there's a lot of bad guys around. If I go outside, and there's a lot of bad guys around, are we going to die? How close are they? Yeah, see, like, they're right on top of us. We can't we can't go scan that. I want to see if it's scannable. It might not even be scannable. Like the previous skeleton, we couldn't scan, so... Ooh! Oh, shit, there's something up there as well. What is that? Oh, okay. I was I was right on the edge of visibility for that, and it's disappeared. Okay, so there's a weird thing in front of us, and there's a thing off to the side. There it is. Interesting. Okay. Shit, which way do we... Oh, no, that's disappeared. What the hell is going on with the camera? I don't know. Okay, there is shit all around us. Right. I want to turn around and check out that. That just looks like a big plant or something. I mean, it look, looks cool, but I, it looks like a big plant. That looks like a building. Oh, shit, yeah. That is a precursor base. Can I get the Cyclops through here? That's going to be the question. Can we actually fit the Cyclops in here? I feel like that's a cyclops sized hole. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe I think we're thinner than we actually are. Ooh, that is a... External hull damage that detected. is a busted precursor base. We're fine. We're fine. Wait, no, no, no. You're not going to attack me. Because I'm silent running and you can't see me. It's fine. Okay, we actually got through that pretty well. Um, I am, like, totally scraping the sides. We're going to need a new paint job on this, basically. But other than that, we're fine. Okay. The structure appears to have collapsed to the sea floor. Cause unknown. Competing theories. Sure. Okay. Theorize for me. Go for it. I mean, normally the ones we've seen have been old and like covered in stuff, but this is the, we've not actually seen a busted one before. Like this is the first evidence of violence we've seen. Okay, we've got a couple of those bone eels around. Not much else. Now, I mean, does... What does this mean? Ooh, bones. Oh! Okay, so there's bones here. There's a body next door. And... I don't know what that was. Am I hitting something? Or is it just st stuff driving into me? Or both. I have no idea. Okay. Well, that, I mean, we wanted to go in there anyway, but that makes it me want to go in there more. Um, so we've got bones over here, and if you look at the damage on here, it's like it's ripped out, like something attacked it from outside and tore open the plating to get inside. Maybe it got attacked by, by that beastie back there. Although I don't know what that beastie would have died of. I mean, it's can't see any gun turrets or anything on this. Also, why would it attack it? I haven't seen any of the others been attacked. And there's definitely like, reapers and stuff around them. 
Let's try and do a circuit of this. What was that? Oh, shit. Oh, wait. Hey, sorry. I just ran you over. Um, I think one of our batteries just died, actually. Is that what that noise is? Okay, we've got a couple of damage. I need to fix that at some point. Um, I keep hearing a noise, and I'm not sure what it is. Is it batteries running out of power? I think it might be the batteries. Yep, yeah, okay, that was a noise. That was one of the batteries. So we're down one battery. That's fine. I mean, that's not a problem. Wow, this place is actually pretty big. Now, if we, when we go outside, we're going to have to be careful because we've got warpers Warning. and phonians. And we're very far down. I mean, I'm tempted to see if I can just take the prawn suit in there, but I, I kind of doubt that thing's going to fit. So this is like something they used to anchor it to the sides. So I don't know why they just wouldn't build on the ground, but hey. Aliens, man. You can't, you can't judge aliens for doing alien shit. This cavern is huge. I kind of wish I'd built that sonar mapping thing. In fact, I wonder if I can build it. I don't know what that actually requires. I might have to look that up at the fabricator and see what actually, what actually that entails. But okay, we have a giant alien base which we need to explore. There are hostiles around. But we can defend ourselves. I mean, as long as my FPS isn't screwing me over again, I can try and freeze them and get away. We've just got to find a way in. That's the thing. I haven't, I haven't seen anything that looks like an opening, apart from that one there that looks like an opening. Uh, okay, let's see. Can I get the camera in a position where I can look in there? Let's bring you around. Because I could actually, I could probably get the, the prawn suit in there. That'd be kind of awesome. Ending. That definitely looks like an opening, doesn't it? Warning. External hull damage detected. Yeah, something's ripped off that whole side. Right. I think our mission is to try and get inside there and take a look around. But I think we're going to do that next time because I need to take a break before this episode runs on too long. And also, I really need a drink. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you're enjoying all this. Do feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe if you are. And hopefully, I'm going to see you later for the next one of these. Bye.